I, I should have mentioned, because it was a, a very important part of my life, on the 19th of December, 1953, I married a 10-pound pom by the name of Joan. And uh, this was the third girl I'd been engaged to, but this time we got married. And uh, that was on the 19th of December, 1953. On the 4th of January, 1954, we sailed away to establish this Antarctic base, which we did at Mawson. So 15 months later, we come back, and I'm leaning on the rail, and in Melbourne, the ship can come right up to the city and the river. And I had right beside me a good old mate who had been with a couple of other bases, Len Macy from Coogee, radio man. And I said, oh, look, then there's your wife over there, Peggy. He said, yes, I expected it, Peggy. I said, I wonder who that good-looking girl standing beside Peggy is. That says, then, is your wife, John. So my wife, Joan, was my wife and a wonderful woman, too, for 59 years and died eight eight years ago in Redcliffe Hospital, cancer and one other problems. And my daughter, who is very close and is very much like my wife, my only child incidentally, Susan, is here looking after me now. <laughs>